everything. It is a lot of work that these guys are doing. They're, they're putting in their own time just for you guys. So, you know, your support is so appreciated and it makes us want to keep doing these events. Thank you guys so much. We're going to get into the super hype grand finals. Jetstream Sal versus Defukai. We have Sephukai with the winner's advantage, but, um... Yeah. My eyes are on uh, Sal's uh, higher move, because uh, it's, it's definitely gotten my attention tonight. Yeah, so Sal is showing off a lot of like a lot of the tech, right, and like the, like the optimal combos, so the optimal that we know of so far. And great sidestep, knowing the string, gonna get the punish. Okay, doesn't stand up into the second hit, so gonna get hit by it. But okay, still life lead right now, kind of backing up, poking at Zeph. And there's that classic kind of like Zephukai one K. Yep. Uh, yep. it worked out both. Oh, but the cancel! Great stuff. What a great duck and punish. Hey, he, he must have hurt us. <laughs> yeah, for sure, right? You're gonna get those more optimal punishes. You have to be getting those. But Zephkai with great positioning right now. But the 1k. Yeah, you know what's yeah, you know the challenge? Is. 1k is uh, definitely stand on hit. So Space uh, Sal knows to just like bounce it, take his turn. Uh, so we'll exactly. see if Zephkai can catch on to that and maybe implement more uh, GIs and uh, auto GIs to uh, respond to uh, Sal doing that. Exactly, yeah. Without that counter hit, his 1k is not nearly uh, as as good. It's not like a Sophie where it's only like negative 2 on hit. Uh, it's like, I, think I heard like negative 8 on regular hit without counter hit. But, but with Zephyrkai being the Shanghua and Sophie T uh, main, as to like being able to take his own uh, uh, frame disadvantage uh, and turn it into an advantage uh, in the form of um, you know good movement and uh, good placement of GIs. Exactly, you know, it's a really it's a high level technique of like frame disadvantage advantage. Okay, Sal trying to go in with these hit confirms, but not quite getting them. Oh, uh, nice block punish here. Okay, where are we going? All right, the heavy slash coming through. Proposed uh, the the duck. Oh, it didn't get the full confirm. Popping soul charge here. Trying to keep his advantage going. Great duck. Doesn't get the cancel again. Oh. Sal, you gotta be getting those. If only that was a heavy slash, I would just end it around already, but doesn't matter. He yes. picked up anyway. Yeah, he needs to be later. going for these heavy slashes. He has to be going for it. He's dropping so much damage. And he's been going for a harder combo. Okay. Oh, nice. I like the fake. Doesn't go complete the string. I'll see. Okay, getting the combo. Okay. Yo, no sword stance? Yo, we out there. Trooper roll. I like it. It's a good way to get out of stance. I'm out of here. God, and this character's movement is just so clean. Right, he's got the wall pressure right now. Zephyr kind of looking very really strong. Just poking at Sal with the throw. Gonna change Whoa. position. Get the wall splat. Yo, let's go. Round three. Okay, goes with the Oki. Doesn't get a ton of damage, but that looks so sick. <laughs> yeah, that was, yeah, that was cool. That was like no damage. That was like 55 damage for all of that. No, no, no. That is not a punish. Yeah. Sal, you can just prop your own CE. Yep, there it we is. go. Ow! Yeah, so that Dragon Punch is only negative 18. And Haramaru's Critical Edge is 20 frames. So that is two frames of uh, you lost the game. Welcome to the stage of history. Oh, wait, so that actually wasn't a block punish? No, it is not a block punish. It is a negative 18 oh move. <laughs> his, the, his critical edge is, I believe, 20 frames. It is. Oh wait! Oh no, no, that was that was the um the six A plus B plus K version. That's the six version, so that's definitely faster. That's 14 frames. Was it? I don't think that was. Uh, yeah, yeah, because um, um, I think the confusion is that um, what Zubaz is talking about is what Zeph used when Zeph super to punish the DP. That's uh, the DP that Zeph was trying to hold. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. And then the block punish that Sal ended up using was uh, was 14. Correct. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I got gotcha. you. Yeah. My bad. <laughs> okay, I'm supposed to go into the next round with the 4 4 K. Yo, anti airs? Okay, let's go. Anti airs, you're anti airing your own flip kick with my flip kick? I like it. Oh, nice. Ooh, with the again, horizontal. Man. Nice, Zeph going in. Working all the stance pressure. Nice use of just two uh, step PG. Nice. Sal going with the stance pressure of his own. A okay, single 6B. I like the 6B and just in to back away. Just trying to throw off Zeph's timing. Yep, he's making a... pressure with him, just like creating the space between the two players. Back to the game. Of 
caught his ba uh, back step, so that's interesting. So he's, he's trying to catch the movement now. For sure. Okay, nice, though. Gonna get the AA counter hit. Zephyr Kai tying it up in rounds. Ooh. Uh, interesting change of pace. Like the throw tech, but no, that was a command throw. Plus on, plus on throw tech. Well, there, there's that fake. Hey, I like Zephyrkai challenging the 1Ks, though. Backing up, just throwing buttons at each other. Oh, oh drops God, the call. So much range. Yeah, this character's so much range. Okay, I like it. Gets the throw. Throwing Zep or throwing uh, south towards the edge. The BB. Oh, this is gonna be it. Oh my goodness, yeah. Oh, not oh. quite enough. Too far for the ring out. You, so you have to be like almost point blank back to the edge of that connect. Uh, and he doesn't get the he doesn't get the soul attack without the uh, two three six B lethal hit. So he was not able to actually convert that into a ring out, unfortunately. Okay, nice, going in with the low stance, Hell Sweep, backing up. I like the challenge, that was on block. Yeah, it's not a plus transition on block. Training blows, but we got Rage instead of Zephyrkai, but he eats the DP. Now going in very aggressively this time yes. and closes out the round. Yeah, well, putting a lot of work at the 2-2-K at the end of that round. It was a great stance transition, even on block. Kind of have to eat it, but the side throw from Zephyrkai. Gonna knock him down. Takes a swig. Healing that guard gauge a little bit. Getting a little bit of life back. Oh, two to B. It's gonna be a lot of damage. But Rage Explosion on deck for both players. Uh, yeah. Now, yeah, Edsel has full access to it. You pop his soul charge. Got two bars of meter. Come on, Ooh. pop it. Yeah, yup. Yeah, just do a big sidestep. So you gotta use your meter, you got two bars. There, there we go, you're gonna pop it. Now this is a really scary oh, situation. Oh my god! Right that is so much damage. But now Zephyrkai has one of his own. Oh! Check out beat him. Oh my god, he pushes him out oh my of the god. chart. He pushed him out of it. <laughs> got punched in the face. Ate his oh. meter and ate his life. I think Zephyrkai was just kind of surprised that he Welcome didn't the stage of history. pop his soul charge. I think he was just holding four A plus B plus K, so he just wasn't blocking. Yeah, he let go for a second whether to uh, do um, a soul charge C or whatever, but yeah, got hit uh, hit out of it by that I-12, 6-6-K. I-12! Yeah, so that was, uh, that was really... And then the 2K, because I think, yeah, uh, as I said before, I'm pretty sure Zeph thought... He, he was just holding it down to get that rage explosion, right? So, unable to block during He just wasn't expecting it, so he just wasn't blocking because, you know, he's trying to get that rage explosion. <laughs> so good. Uh, <laughs> what a what a crazy interaction. Oh, yeah, we got home surf advantage. Jetstream Sal, uh, looking to reset the bracket here. Very strong versus Efukai. Oh, doesn't get the punish. There we go. That guy got them. R and K. Into the two A. <laughs> we just trade and blows back and forth. Doesn't get the hit confirmed. Goes in the throw instead. That guy kind of just spacing him out, letting Sal kind of just hang himself in this match. Okay, with Sal going in, gonna get the two two K. But I think Zeph is just kind of okay, kind of spaced it out. There we go. Gonna go into the stance, guesses the 50-50. Even if he guessed wrong in the 50-50 there, he wasn't dead. So I think he was just okay with kind of taking that risk. Yeah, it's almost an uh, interesting uh, role reversal in that first round. You see uh, Sal uh, being the one to uh, create some opportunities using a uh, movement and forcing his opponent to hang themselves. But that round was Zeph guy doing all that. For sure. Zeph guy just walking around, just dancing around. I'm gonna get the throw. Trying to even up the life bar, healing himself up a little bit. Oh, oh my god, that's a lot of damage. Yeah, great size that into that with punish, getting all that damage. Oh, stands up just a little too early. And that's one thing that Zeph is really good at, it's just kind of like mixing up his timing, delaying them slightly, and just look at all this chip damage. Oh yeah, yeah, you, you, you said it perfectly, yeah, just um, yeah, mixing up his timings, um, staggering his offense, he's just really good at just trying to throw off your um, uh, your defenses when he's approaching you. Exactly, and that's one of Zeph's. That's one of his biggest strengths as a player. Yeah, doesn't matter what character he's on. Exactly. Okay, going to the stomps. 
Or like, okay, Sal just poking him out now, trying to kind of keep himself safe. I like the cancel again, kind of just delaying the pressure. <laughs> that 4B is just ridiculous. Right, gonna get the BP though, getting to Oki. Oh, but not gonna. Oh, Sal doesn't drop the confirm. He drops the confirm. Very uncharacteristic from him. Nice. And the ring oh. out. Oh, my goodness. That 2 2 K is just so good. On counter hit, gonna get the combo. Yo, we got just frames? Okay, got the electric one. Godfist. Let's go. Hey, wake up. Where are we going? We're going low into a counter hit. Ryan's gonna hit 6 BB. So many low hits. Yeah, one thing I noticed that Sal does a lot more than any other Hamaru is that 6 6 K. Even in neutral. Oh, dude. The punch? What the? 3 K. Yeah, he makes a lot of work out of that stuff. It's amazing. Uh, it's amazing. Yeah, it's really good. It's crazy range. Crazy range, crazy plus frames. Very fast at 12 frames. Yep, and you can kind of like, you've seen him kind of just like chain it back and forth. He was like 6 k 6 k 6 k 3 Yeah, it's because on hit, it's literally uninterruptible. Yep. I mean, you have to duck it, yeah, but Buttons are not going to beat it unless it has that crotch. Exactly. Precise that. So two to one in uh, grand finals. This is no reset. So Zephyrkai wins two more games in a row. Uh, we're gonna go going back to the same stage right now. Okay. Which I'm happy about. I, I the new stage look really cool. And plus, I like that in this stage, um, the, the announcer changes. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty. So you get the Sam Show announcer. You got the you got the homie in the background. You know, he's supporting. <laughs> yeah, that's the guy like your number one fan. Look at him. Look how happy he is. He's just happy to be there. Incredible. Okay, goes with the goes with the dodge, but uh, unfortunately he got the hit, so he didn't actually get anything out of it. Nice, that six B. That six B is such a wide hitbox too. Looks like he caught like a counter hit as uh, Sal was trying to sidestep. Oh, gonna get the okay, he's like, ah, the sword. Okay, yo, you doing it raw? Nice throw tech, Sal. So hard to throw, but the whip punish. You know, he's going for that back turn B plus K a lot. Nice block. Going goes with the AA. Could go a little bit more. Minus uh, 16, at least. Yes, minus 16. You gotta go to BB at least. Nice. Gonna get the BP. And just throwing these pokes out. Excel is so on point, punishing those 1Ks. But Zeph guy just kind of playing patient, kind of just playing neutral. I like the, the, the delay on the throw, kind of like that Sophie fundamental coming through. Oh, he went for it, but he got the run. He didn't get the two B plus K, he got just regular B plus K. Oh, but the rage extension. Gonna be able to secure the round. Man, that's the unique camp to Harmaru when he's at low life. Kind of gets his own little dark legacy. Catches the uh, sidestep there. Good step killer from Sal. He bars the meter though. Plus frames pushes it, but that's got a good slice step. That Sal throw. needs to be using his meter way, way more aggressively. He's died with two meters in the last game. He's looking for like he's gonna die two meters in this game too. That could cost him. Could Sal? You gotta use your meter. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! And just trading four bees. There we go. Popping rage explosion. Oh yeah! Just going all in already. I mean, he got it. Wow! 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 That's not much damage. <laughs> but his just a little bit better. If he manages to um, hit this particular match here, it will all be because of that rage explosion uh, comeback there. Exactly, but now Zephyrkai still has his rage explosion available. If he even needs it in this round. Looking just so strong. Wow, he's gonna get it. This is gonna ring out. It's gonna be a ring out. Okay, all the way to the edge. 14 hit combo does get the ring out. Oh, wow. <laughs> you didn't tech the throw, my dude. Okay, gonna get the throw himself. Doesn't get the command throw, though. <laughs> oh, he dropped the combo. Strong character is Sal. Gonna get the counter hit into the low. And them guys looking very strong. And no meter for Sal. So this is a really bad spot to be in. He doesn't really have much of a comeback in this round. Can't even try and get that cheeky ring out. Except for Kai looking really strong. He's kind of poking at him. One yeah. hit away. 
Nice control, just adding up just a lot of little hits that just over time just leads to the round win, and therefore the match. Right. 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 Yeah, no, Me too. Right. Mm -hmm. And that's one of the strengths of Harmaru is the, that command throw mix up is so strong, and you, you can kind of just forget about it for a second. Uh, and if you do, it's like, oh, wait, I'm dead. It's just so scary. Yeah, you have to be focusing on it. Now, no, he does have to spend a bar, and you you can tech the throw, so there, there is that, but uh, it can be definitely very scary. Yeah, I mean, what are you going to do, duck, and then leave yourself open to all of Haramaru's crazy mids? Like, that's... Yeah, and something. even if he does the command throw, even if you tech it, he is still plus eight. But Zephakai, bringing it back right now, <laughs> looking to... Uh... Yeah, that's, that's, even, that's crazy. Uh, that's a guy looking to just take this grand finals. Nice. That was gonna be the combo. Push the plus range, get a little bit extra damage there with that, um, that Oh, he tried to backstep out of the pressure, but no, Zephyr guy not gonna give it to him. Look at all this aggression coming out of Zephyr guy. Okay, there we go. Sal pushing these plus frames, but again, not gonna get the optimal block or the punish on the throw. But still gets damage off it, so. He does add up to a win. It looks like he's going to get it. Wow, okay, the 4-4-K. <laughs> Gotta get the plus frames on him. Into the 3-B, taking the round. Okay, Sal looking strong. What's that guy? Gonna get the 6-B. Uh, counter hit combos. Man, that 6-B is such a big button. It's so powerful. Great GI from Zephukai, though. Into the throw. Wow! Kind of a wide hitbox, wider than it looks. Exactly. Okay, Vertizonals coming through. Ooh, not that wide! 4A. He's just backing up right now. Okay, he gets the Senpu, but Zephukai. Nice stuff. Sal getting the punish. But not gonna get the optimal punish, and Zephukai gonna duck the throw into the whiff punish there from, from the uh, from the whiff throw. It feels like, uh, despite like all these uh, punish opportunities that Sal seems to be finding for himself, he's just still not like uh, winning the damage race uh, against Zephyrkai. Yeah, Zephyrkai's kind of just like chipping him out a lot, kind of mm -hmm. working these like big plus frames. And when Zephyrkai is kind of just like in your head and has your timing, it can be really hard. Wow, that grab range was crazy. Yeah, <laughs> good sidestep. Yeah, if you look at it, Zephyrkai is getting a lot of damage just off like basic chips, uh, you know, neutral exchanges, and. That's kind of where Sal, when he's when Sal gets the like the read on Zephyrkai, he's not getting that like, heavy slash, and he needs to get that. To kind of compete with just the neutral from Zephyrkai. He's not ducking that string either. You gotta duck that. Important string to be ducking. Yes. <laughs> but you know what else is important? Using your meter, Kwong. Got two bars. Both these players. Both the players. Yes. Oh, the heavy slash not connecting just too far away. Yeah, no punish there, but we got raised some from Zephkai right into a CE. Yeah, this isn't gonna be enough to kill, but it's gonna be a lot of damage. Alright. Alright, do or die for Sal. Are we gonna see range explosion? Soul charge? Anything? No! Oh, oh, oh. We're just gonna get in the face by 